Oh, good morning, guys. I didn't know I was there. Welcome to Dogs Are Us. And I want to show you guys how to cook a sudden quick breakfast for you and your beagle. Now, keep in mind, Mr. Beagle is probably somewhere on the chair, somewhere asleep, because you just don't get up around 730. So, it's a snow day. It's cold here. It's like 23 degrees. I was like, well, I did cook breakfast, I mean, uh, dinner last night on uh, Carolina Diamonds Productions. But I'm going to cook a good breakfast on Dogs Are Us, because I am the owner of Mr. Beagle. But you want to know where Mr. Beagle is, guys? Y'all miss him. Here he comes. But I'm going to let you guys spend like five minutes with him while I go wash my face and get in this kitchen and burn some quick breakfast because we hungry around here. Hey, I'm Mr. Beagle, gal. We double stream. I'm double streaming on uh, Carolina Diamond and I'm also double streaming on uh, Dogs R Us. So we're just trying to get this channel going over Mr. Beagle. Mr. Beagle so much, and so he go. He's just laying around sleeping, y'all. I'm going to give you a little bit of him all day today. Then we're going to cook this breakfast about, about 7.15. Mr. Big, your people wants to see you, boy. Here you go. Dogs are us on you. Ronnie got Carolina Diamonds while I cook this stuff. Y'all see him over there in that tent. Uh-uh. Oh, in my bed. Where is that, Mr. Big? Oh, there you go. Mr. Big is right here. Oh. Mm. Morning. It's time to get up seven thirty. Uh, so yeah, that's the time. Of... Mm -hmm. Everybody yoga, no yoga today though. Yoga all day yesterday. Uh, 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 I don't need my man's out. Mr. Beagle. Mr. Beagle. I'm sorry, I had to tell you I report that Mr. Beagle ate about a whole pot of uh, pinto beans last night, so you know he ain't going to get up this time. He, he parted hardly last night. Come <laughs> <laughs> on in. Yeah, I'm telling you, so we'll get like 20 some degrees. Beagles don't do nothing but lay around. It's too damn cold. That, that's that's a hunting dog, right? That's a hunting beagle. <laughs> that's why I be kicking. He be moving the hunt. You have to think about uh, rabbits. Oh, cute. Yeah, I'm tired of watching that. Oh, he's stretching, y'all. Boom. Um, oh. Wait, we're gonna get Mr. Beagle up. All I gotta do is cook. Look, get his ass up. Does he get to smell that good old ass? I'm sorry. <laughs> Streaming already, so. Guys, gonna get up in here and cook this food, y'all. Mm. Yeah, now Mr. Beagle laying right on the chair and stuff, y'all. So, I'm gonna cook this other breakfast. It's gonna be cheese, eggs, grits, and uh, cheese toast. And plus a pot of coffee. Normally I would cook like some sausage and bacon or something like that, but since we had uh, um, pinto beans and ham hocks and cornbread and uh, that mix it over rice, no meat today. So with that being said, guys, um, I'm gonna get up in the next two minutes because my lawn said get up and go cook. And that's when I that's when I cook. And running don't tell me what to do with my live stream. He told me to cut the alarm off without any cigar. Yeah, he's a nice uh, bow he is. So when he get done, I'm going to get to cooking, y'all. Lord, I'm just thinking about how I'm going to do my hair today. I'm thinking about how I'm going to do my hair. Guys. I'm going to keep it up with the bone too. It's cold. Cheers, guys. I've been live streaming all night, y'all. I'm tired, dog tired. But you know what? I do this because I love this, you know? I love cooking. I love being a homebody. And this is really the vlog one of, you know, the COVID-19 down in North Carolina where you got to wear a mask and everything else. So I'm just giving you guys a, a, a proportion of what we do. We record, record production, you know, music to whatever on Carolina Diamonds and Dogs are Us. This is its own self-entity. 
we are dogs are us. We tell you about dogs, all the dogs in our house. Uh, as you guys know, I had Jacob, Joshua, Jason. Uh, oh, shit, he getting up, y'all, Mr. Beagle, because he knows somebody been the store cooking. When he see running move, he moves. He's a, he, he, no, he ready. He, yeah, I want to see him straight. There you go. Okay. Y'all gonna watch a little bit of news. I probably cook about seven thirty. So it's on Mr. Beagle because you guys come to see him, not me. Take it out. Resources to be able to um, do medical. Oh, 
Donald Trump money. Donald Trump money. Mr. Beagle. Donald Trump money. Tell him. Donald Trump money. Donald Trump money. Oh. Mr. Beagle. You got a cold. I'm going to get you some goddamn nightclub. Yeah, he got a cold, y'all. Yeah, he got a cold, so I got to give him some uh, NyQuil. You give him a, a te- teaspoon of NyQuil in that water or rubber tussle. He'll be just fine. Um, that demonstrated um, a bit of decreased efficacy as noted um, in the Nova Vax. I want some Donald Trump money. Donald Trump money. Money. Donald Trump money. Some of the dry sample today. Don't put it on your ass or your ass smell like fruit chips. Donald Trump money. 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 Donald I'm going to chill out. You want me to go to the mall? I guess I'm. How about you? Give me some work. No, I think no, you don't want to. You ain't got to cook me. Hey, what's going on? Hello, how are you? Sound church hunts and crying. What's going on, man? You're not making this on the AP 420 network. You're doing one round of metal detector. Yes, thank you for subscribing. Hey, man, you got an awesome content. Thank you for dropping by, showing me some love, too. You know, I'll be on the one for one, but I'm going to tell you right now, ain't no Kathy Laggy. It's 23 degrees. I'm going to wait for some. Y'all don't show me the risk of getting. Um, in the absence of getting the vaccine, not knowing, thinking that we believe that the state is not being on the state, but that we don't have the data. So, in my mind, so you're going to lie today, um, town treasure hunter, because we are stuck here and go nowhere. And I'm going to watch a video. Oh, my car is clunked. We are in the road. Maybe I'm Both of them talk to the kids. Um, 
Many public fouls of John Stewart weighing in tweeted, the Redditors aren't cheating. They're joining a party Wall Street insiders have been enjoying for years. All right, those are us. Y'all want dick? See, not that, not that, not that, not that. See there? Time to go work. Yes, here, Lydia. All right, guys, let's get this breakfast started. First thing we're going to do is make some coffee here. All right, guys, the first thing we're going to do is make some coffee. Now, some of y'all might not have no filters. That's okay. I'm going to show what the trick that we learned in Army. 34 years, guys, 35, something like that. Just retired. So when I'm out in the field, I'm going to get me a cup of, cup of Joe. And I ain't got no filter. Guess what I do? Paper towels, your best friend, honey. That bouncy towels, it don't matter. So I'm going to do with this. First of all, I got to get the thing in going. Huh? Hold on, like right that. Stick it in there. Double fold it and stick it in the uh, coffee uh, holder. <laughs> Any blend of coffee is fine. Each tablespoon, each coffee. Since this is a five tablespoon, uh, five cup holder, it's five tablespoons. <laughs> Make sure it just so the coffee doesn't come out. Because if it does, you're going to have some nasty coffee, y'all. Fill up that, fill up your pot, coffee pot. What <laughs> coffee nice guys always makes on that? If you like me put cold rocks in water, wait till I can go see my cold rocks system, got to give me this. You got to read it, cha cha cha. <laughs> so fill it up to the five cups. Pour it in there. Pull it down, plug it up, turn it on. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, cheese and eggs, that's how we do it around here. And get some grits going. Give me some toast and cheese on it, that's all. A little coffee. Whatever you want to throw your stuff. So, first, I got to do one thing with the stove back there. I'm playing my stuff last night. So, I got to put it back in there. I don't have my benzo. If you guys get a chance, can you check out Jesus the Freak? And it's it's called Jesus Freak. And the name of the video is uh, Cypress Hill. The I don't have my benzo. He be rocking, y'all. Hey, he be rocking for the Canada. Anyway, we're getting back to the video. Friday party, y'all. Come on, come on, Carolina Diamond Production. We about to get it on in here. Yes, yes, yes. Ready to bring, y'all. So, that being said, I need a pot for the grits. So, what you're going to do, I'll get you a pot. Not too much. We're going to cook for a big family. Probably need one of these, but since my family is not that big, but since I need a my man and my dog. You me one, Mr. Grinch. All right. 
Take a shot. I always wash my pots out, guys. Always wash the pots out. I don't know. It's that COVID-19, man. Me, me and COVID-19 ain't no damn good friends, so I have the low rise everything down. That's just me. You know, I don't know what you do, but me, I'm going to put down the low rise everything. I'm going to kill all those terms, all right? So I put my water in. I'm not going to put that much in there. That's just too much in right there. Put about, I don't know, about two or three cups. Two or three cups. For your grits, put it on the back. Some butter. She's got that heat up too high for now. But anyway, I ain't gonna say anything because my old family code, I'm just hot flashing. But anyway, menopause, ladies, you just gotta ignore it. It's a natural thing, you can't help that. Not me, but I understand, don't you know what? Do like I do. Cuss that motherfucking ass out. Get the hell on. <laughs> but anyway, about, uh, two, ta two ta uh, tablespoons of butter, uh, milk. Better get good or not. Well, you put them grits in there, y'all. Oh, yeah. Gonna get butter for the uh, cheese and eggs, so let's get that going. I tell you what, I'm gonna get going. I'm gonna get my toast going first. Even though I got a toaster. That pops up. I want cheese on my toast. I'm going to put it in the stove old fashioned. It's bubbling up now. Yeah. So, I'm going to cheese those on two or one. One. You're going to back your car at 23 degrees a day. Well, something wrong with you, boy. You want cheese on your toes or you want butter on your toes? All right, cheese. Cheese want cheese on your toes. I don't mind, sir. Roger that, sir. Roger that. And yes, we are a military family. We got a military dog, a military boyfriend. I am military. So if you don't know, well, I'm talking because I was a retired sergeant major. Well, I am a retired sergeant major. But it's all good. We have, there's many sergeant majors in the Army. But when you make E7 above, that means you're the top of the top of the cream, baby. Top of the cream. I'm E9, the highest you can go. That's pretty good for a sister like me. <laughs> now, with that being said, guys, I'm going to cut me some cheese up, put it on this thing. I made a bread. I'm going to say thank you. <laughs> All right, guys, let's speed this up a little bit. I'm going to cook breakfast. Normally, I'll be already added on and ate and had my coffee. And we slept in because we was pretty much working hard last night, live streaming, you know, having already fun like we always do around here in the North Kakalaki. Hey, COVID-19, I suggest you guys start doing YouTube channel. Shit. Oops. Let's network. Let's network. That's what we do. Let's go. Let's go. Let's grow. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn my stove on. I'm gonna turn uh, the grits up. I want the boiling, so I'm gonna turn up on H. My stove, I'm gonna turn on to about, about no, 500. Depending on your stove, you know your adjustments to get yourself going. So, good lord, I'm hungry. I'm so hungry, boy. I'm glad I can open cheese. I'm hungry, y'all. I got to eat. So, I'm gonna cut three. three Oh, Lord, I hate when you don't know what's going on. Y'all so, give me a run. I'm, I'm going to take care of running. You're going to get the hell out of my kitchen. You know that? So three pieces of cheese. I'll eat a piece of bread. Right. I'm going to show you guys just the amount. Just cut this cheese right quick. Okay. I am hungry. Ooh. Eat. Hunger, hunger, hunger. One more slice. Here we go. So guys, this is what we got going on here. I'm just gonna put that in the stove. Got two of them going on. I don't know, Mr. Big Lake Cheese or not, so I'm not gonna make him any. He got his dog over here. Watch the damn meat. So we're gonna keep that in there. Put the cheese in the bread. Cheese in the bread. Carolina done. 
Is it in there? And let it go. Oh, I got the wrong aisle, guys. Yeah. All right, let that go. Next thing now is the uh, grits. Good now, the cheese and the eggs. The most important thing for me, I love cheese and eggs, guys. Very easy, very easy. So what you're gonna do is get your little spatula, whatever going on. Got like soap. Tablespoon of butter. some milk, three eggs, a bowl, all right, and I like to whip my eggs, guys, and I'll be making a type of cake, guys, for you, uh, for you guys who want to know how to bake, I'll be making a homemade chocolate cake, so I'll upload that video, because I started last night, and I'm just going to finish my icing, for you guys, it should be coming from here sometime today, not today, tomorrow, because I do need to eat it, but getting back to this live stream, cooking, you're going to need three eggs, Three medium size, well, three large eggs. One, two, three. Now I'll add a little bit of milk. Add a little bit of milk in your eggs and a little bit of milk in your grits. What milk does is enhances the oats and the uh, barley inside of the, and it gives your food a boom. You know what I'm saying? A, 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 a delicious, smooth flavor. And plus, it gets the lumps out your grits. Oh my God, I'm sorry. Now, with that being said, guys, I'm going to um, get me a little fork here and make sure that I get saturated. My, my, um, damn, I got the wrong eye on that. I actually do. So I'm going to go ahead and set your, I get wrong now. Well, that warm up, and then I'll just come over here and just beat my eggs. You want to beat it where the yolk is uh, very, is you, you pop your oak, scramble it all around. <clears throat> and if you want to, you can go ahead and add your cheese inside here or there, it don't matter. It all to come together, guys. So now I can just put all my other ingredients up. That coffee just taking this sweet time. What's going just fine? Y'all, it's 24 degrees. Good God Almighty. Oh. All right. Now. Something that I do, I don't know about you guys, but I like to put a little onions, onions in my eggs. Ooh, yes. It wakes up the flavor, it enhances your cheese. So I put a little bit of onions. Give you an oxygen to your skin. It's been known to cure some strains of COVID-19. And it just tastes good to me. I love onions. I don't get too much of them because, you know, I don't like cutting so many onions, but just a little bit. You want to chop them up real fine. And we're going to put this inside of our eggs in the batter. All right. So my butter's going on pretty good, guys. And I'm chopping up my onions. Oh, yes. I'm very good at this. So take your time, guys. I want you guys to get your fingers up. I'm pretty good at it, though. So I took a course of culinary, uh, culinary art. And uh, being an army, because I was a quartermaster, so, you know, I know how to do a dining facility and all that. And I picked up a lot of shit in there. And when I switched over to supply sergeant, then I was like, oh, hell no, that's not going to give me the rank I need. Then I switched over to signal corps. So, with that being said, a little bit, and plus, so, you know, being North Cadillac, you just know how to burn a cure point blank. From music experience, watching your grandma, and just, hey, you got to know how to cook. So, anyway, you just turn all that, just like that. And at the same time, what you're going to do is go cut three slices of cheese, two or three, depends on what you how, how you like it. Some people don't like cheese, but I did. 
So you cut them up one, three out of three big old slices. Because you want more cheese, the more better. And since I'm on a diet, I ain't gonna try to be a big old fat ass. So let me just put three, three over here. You put that back in the refrigerator. Now, guys, you want to stir it up? Stir it up like motherfucking coffee. <laughs> no, but look, here's my beer here. So stir it up like coffee. And then what you're going to do next? So make, sure you, excuse me, make sure your butter is with all over your pan. The one thing I hate doing is pouring out a pan with eggs in it. So the more butter you put, the more your eggs come out. So I'm going to go ahead and turn out my um, grits up to a higher, about eight or nine, because I want to go and put my grits in it. All right, by the time these eggs are shit together, you know, everything will come together. All right, so next thing you're gonna do, go ahead and pour that batter in there. Like so. Now, me, during this time, what is happening? I do one or two things, smoke a cigarette or clean up. So guess what? I'm trying to quit smoking, I'm cleaning up. I love the clean kitchen, guys. Now, what I should have done in the South, what we do is use canned biscuits, you know, and basically you take that, you can use molasses, jelly, put cheese in it, or make a sausage, cheese, egg, and biscuit, but, but is that, this is for Sunday, okay? Sunday coming at you. So, now we just wait, 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 wait. Boil the grits, and they're, but they're real hot, so hey, go ahead and put your salt. I put a little bit of onion salt in my um, eggs, right there, just a little bit. And guys, let me tell you one secret that my grandma always told me. Don't ever be afraid to season your food. And the reason why I like using acid is like a lower form of sodium. You know, use this right here. You won't be no high blood pressure. Bam! There you go. Accent. A little bit in there. Y'all know what I get that bam from. I've been watching too much AAP for Twitter. You got me hyped up, y'all. That's my boy, Messiah Kekulaki. Right down the road. Okay, got that going on. A little bit of pepper. And I don't put too much salt in my food. I let Ronnie put his own salt in his food because he likes salt. I don't. So uh, that's why I put so much salt in my food, guys. But anyway, put a little bit of black pepper in there. That's baby. Yep, 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 yep. Now, why that uh, milk and uh, water and my black pepper and salt going on in there? Now I'm ready to put my grits in there. Any grits, any grits is fine. So today's purpose, I'm gonna use some. Uh, I'm gonna make that. I'm gonna have to do rice. Yeah. Cause I hate sitting and thinking I got to do this. Time to make a grocery run, y'all. Grocery run. Lord, I don't think we got no grits running. So instead of you ain't got no grits, go ahead and use rice. Same thing, but I thought I bought some grits. I know I did. The devil is a lie. We always got grits at our house. This will be the first time in, in many years I don't. So I'm over here checking, checking. And guess what, guys? We don't have any grits. So guess what I'm going to do? Rice it. Put rice in. Rice, 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 rice. So guess what? Change the plans. There's going to be cheese, eggs, and rice. The rice is the same thing as grits. You know, white form, you know? I'm going to find a damn rice. I'm just surprised that it's not going to do. Here we go. <laughs> Rice. Oh, Lord. She overblowing, Lord. So I need to turn it down some. Go ahead and put my rice in there. All right. Move out. So with that being said, it's going to take the rice about 20 minutes to cook. It'll take 20 minutes to cook. I'll turn up about five minutes Take five minutes off, I'll turn it up on an extra notch. Um, so we'll go ahead, get some other chunk of pork, stir everything up, stir it up. And me for my rice, I'm gonna put something over it because I don't want my rice to be falling over my eyes and shit. So, you might have been done by now, but we're gonna wait because we don't have any grits. In the meantime, turn everything down and chill out, you know, everything but nice and low because we gotta wait on the rice, right? I like everything to be simultaneously come together, you know, and that's when you know you're a good cook. When everything is done at the same time, you know? Oh, the cheese is looking good. The cheese is looking good. So what I'm going to do right now is just turn up my cheese and eggs. I just don't want to use the other cheese, but you know what I understand. 
Certain things you gotta learn how to adjust because COVID 19 a lot of things are closed. You might say like 2,000 miles from the store, and you just hate going. But uh, when you don't have certain things like coffee filters, use paper towels, um, then if you don't got any grits, use some rice. You know, if you're trying to be healthy, use brown rice instead of white rice. You know, so small, simple changes, you know, your diet or your, your, your regimen can make you more healthy. You know, that's how I look at it. You know, if anything, somebody tell me something. Better me, I'm gonna use it. That's me. Okay, these things right here too. Put them on medium. And you turn this eye off. I need my glasses on. And the next thing I'm gonna do is just keep that rice on seven because I want to hurry up because I'm ready to eat, y'all. And you know what I just thought about that fucking rice in the damn fridge right last night. Oh, I just thought about it. Oh my god, am I sleeping, y'all? I ain't sleeping here. I'll just cook too damn much. I, like, I didn't have to cook this morning, but I decided to cook. Ryan's home. You know, I'm not with some leftovers from last night's dinner, you know? But, you know, when you got a man or whatever, you got to cook for him because, you know, the way to their heart is good cooking. And that right, Mr. Mark? Yeah. Yeah. Believe me. That's why I'm almost there. Yes, I do. All right, I got time. We're going to sit down and talk to you guys for a minute. I'm going to come back and check on it. But let's give you a brief synopsis. First, we're going to start with Dogs Are Us. Here. You see the cheese and eggs begin. And then, so let's check on this, uh, the toast. Carolina, I'm going to get you next. Look at it. Oh, yes, baby. We got to wait for it to get brown. Y'all see it? And the rice is just getting started, so I ain't going to go there. Put you, uh, Dogs Are Us, back over here because I'm cooking with both channels. All right, so now, oh, Carolina Diamonds Production. Let's see what's going on. Y'all already know I can burn over here. Look, bam, we get some cheese and eggs coming together. Look at that, that toast there. Oh, my goodness, Lord, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Nice. Oh, we gotta wait on the rice. But in the meantime, guess what we're gonna do? Chillax. <laughs> That's what we do. So, when this stuff comes together, guys, the rice should be about 15 minutes. So, uh, I don't know if I can wait that long. That rice is going to be something else. But we, got, we got rice in there, so I can go ahead and mimic that away with that rice to cook for dinner for later on. Because I am going to be cooking another dinner tonight to upload on my uh, Carolina Diamonds Diner. So this is the purpose of all this cooking, y'all. Videos, videos, videos. You know, they, my family don't mind eating. I don't mind doing it, because that's the one thing I love doing is cooking for my family. Yes, 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 please believe me. Oh, let me turn y'all back on me. I'm sorry about that. Uh, Carolina Diamonds production. Oh, guys, thanks for the four thumbs up. Two people in the house. Yes. So you had to put that no Kekulek Southern uh, breakfast here. Bam, can I get a thumbs up? Like, subscribe, want to see more cooking. Can I get a one in the chat, please? Well, I guess you want guys want to see how it tastes. Anyway. Oh, I need to lose some weight, baby. Y'all see all that jump in the dust here twerking, y'all. Oh, yeah, I'm going to get it in. Y'all, you know, it's sad news. I hate to report that uh, Miss Sweet Cicely Tyson died at 96 years old. Also, I used to watch this show called Mary Tyler Moore. Uh, sweet little young lady, I can't remember her name. Um, uh, she, meant, she looked like Samantha. She played on Bewitched to Me. But she died at 92 years old. She used to be on, had her own show for a very long time. My mom and I used to watch it. And, uh, I think, and then she was on, um, what's that show, uh, when they danced all, all the time? Well, that's what she did. And she just passed away. And those, those ladies right there, to be in Hollywood, they look so good. They was inspiration to a lot of us, like people that was born in the 70s like me. They used to watch over us while mom and daddy were going to work, you remember? And Roots, oh my God, who could ever forget Roots and Miss Jane Pittman? You know, when I heard about them dying, I just cried. And that's what I did. My eyes were swollen with crying, guys. That that really hurt me, man. Robin Williams, when he died, it, it hurt me. Ray Sample died, it hurt me. I mean, if they were a part of my 
childhood. My people die, I, I cry. I don't care if superstar or not. Michael Jackson, Lord of the World, cried. Prince cried. Hell, Kirk Cobain cried. Oh, God. This is crazy. At least I can say one thing about Cicely Tyson, the honorable Cicely Tyson, and the legendary of that young, beautiful lady named Cleo Mary Tyler Moore. They were very, very, it was very instrumental in my, my growth. They became my mom, my mom TVs, you know? My TV, I mean, my mother on TV when my mother was working three or four jobs on music to make sure that we had everything so we'd be on welfare. So, my mother's a military woman. My dad is too. So that's why I say the things I do. Time to get this stuff up out of here, y'all. Get this good breakfast going because I am done. I'm going to get a plate for money. I'm not going to eat this one because I'm full last night, guys. I might eat later on. And we're going to do something like this. Sorry. So, I'm going to come out here. Get running some of this butt or something. All right. Um, be very careful when getting this chip cheese toast out of the oven. You're burning shit out tonight. I eat the spatula. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Oh, yeah. Oh, that looks so good, y'all. Oh, yes, oh, yes. And uh, turn the stove off. Okay, next thing we're gonna do is um, get these things on the plate. Yeah, boy. Okay. I'm not hungry, guys. This is all for running. Weekend, so today, highs will be getting into the upper 40s. Cool, sunny, perhaps late breeze out of the north. Tonight, another crazy one for us here. Those clear skies, temperatures dropping into the mid 20s. We're about to get close to the main house rock. Yeah, we'll be careful with that. Let me tell you about the rice. I'm going to let the rice just cook for another minute. Turn everything off, except the rice. Plug it up. And let me tell you what one thing about the rice. I cooked rice last night, guys. So this is what I'm going to do since I ain't got any food since. Put some on a plate and uh, put it in the microwave about. See, guys, I cooked rice last night. So, I'm going to put this in a bowl and let it go. That rice right there can be used for dinner tonight. Well, it's not working out right. Let's go to the grocery store. Where do I want to go to the grocery store with COVID 19? Not me. Not the states of me. So, take that and put it in the uh, microwave about two or three minutes. Oh, in my band now. I'll take the rice, put it in my quick about. In a minute, I'm going to show y'all something real funny. <laughs> y'all want to see what Mr. Bigger doing, dogs or us? Oh, that rice is going. Yeah, one good. This is what your dog is doing, y'all. Uh-uh-uh, Mr. Bango. Hey, what's up? He said, y'all, it's 23 degrees. Leave me the hell alone. <laughs> <laughs> so, y'all back, Mr. Bigo back over here. Y'all got a dog for us. You got your, your star back. He's chilling. He'll be going all day. You'll be all with him all day because he got to have so many videos. So, I'm trying to make 10 videos out of one. Now come back to you guys, Carolina. Production of our business thing. Oh, yes, yes. 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 Yes, She's 
see someone that works hard hours trying to make a living for her family and her life was so yeah. stepped out. Detectives watch the store surveillance video. Days together. What Two subjects that are uh, very rapidly. You see a reaction from the, one of the robbery suspects, and then they quickly right, only guys. Okay. We're going to get this bowl up. I have that old fashioned bowl for it. It's there was right there staring me in the face. There is no words to explain how to feel when you know you're responsible for something. You know what I'm saying? It's like. Y'all want to see the photo Here we go. One, two, three. Hey, get somebody get the screenshot. This is a wake-up call. Now, say something. These are real words for that phrase. Your actions caused somebody else's life. You know, and it was for what? You know, for some cigarettes? Yeah. For some money? Yeah. Now you're in this way. Right. You know, but <laughs> I'm done with him. But now he got enough food for the hot water to play dance. I'm done looking for the old day. Long today, still going to work. That's just the way it is. You're right, Ben. Also struggling is her little cousin. It was just really rough for me to sleep. Yeah. Here. You need some salt or anything? No. Now, when my food is good, they're going to tell me two things. I don't want the damn shit or it's good. It's good. It's good. Y'all hear it? Like that Super Bowl kick. It's good. <laughs> Oh, God, I like having one and one, guys. Now, you don't believe what I'm telling you. Check him out. Check him out. Check him out. Is it good, Run it? Yes. What is here? Mr. B. Yeah. Carolina Diamond, Meat Dogs are Us. Uh, 
In the video, one of the suspects brings a purse during the course of our interview. We got to show you guys the final product. Yes, yes. And let me show you what Mr. Beagle We got to shut down this production. Mr. Beagle? Mr. Beagle, are we going live right now? Not right now, later. Well, tell your people goodbye, Mr. Beagle. Say holla, holla. Yeah, okay. All right, guys. Peace. Screenshot. No, it wasn't. That's the cover pie.